good morning, good morning guys. My uh, 10 hour break is just up. So now it is time to get on out of here. Yeah, we just finished doing our pre-trip and all that fun stuff. Checked everything, made sure everything is good. Now we gotta find our exit way out of here and I know it's over there. I know a lot of truck drivers like to leave out of there, but that's not actually where the actual exit is, so uh, we're going to follow this truck. I'm sure he knows where he's going from the looks of things, but yeah, had a good night's sleep. We got us a, finally a shower last night. Yeah, I like that. And there was actually plenty of truck parking spots in here last night. Like you saw, I was able to park right there in the front, right? Which that very rarely does that ever happen at this lot. Like you can see how small it is, right? Like right here, this is the end of it, right? And so I was quite surprised to actually find me a uh, parking spot in here last night. That was, wow. Well, I do not see any stop sign over here, so I don't think we got to stop here. So, this is the way we got to get out of here. Yeah. We are in Sioux City, Iowa. And it looks like it's going to be another nice, clear day again. For the last couple of days in a row, I've had very nice, clear days. And yesterday it actually warmed up really nice too for this time of the year. It was like 16, 17 at times, you know. In a quarter mile, take the entrance to the it left was just on amazing. North. Now I know there is another truck stop across the street there, uh, or across the highway there on the other side. There's a pilot up there and they also have a McDonald's that has a few truck parking spots, but yeah, I like going to the Lowe's, right? I filled my truck right up, and that gets me a free shower. That's what we needed it, in right? And plus, I needed a to the left on parking spot north. for the night. I really did. I needed to be able to park somewhere for the night, and that's what we managed to do over there. Had us a good night's sleep, I'm telling you. I really slept good this night. So, we got 546 miles to make it home. So let's make it happen, guys. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Look at here, guys. All of a sudden, out of nowhere, it started getting really, really, really foggy. And so I've decided, you know what? Let me go ahead and uh, pull in over here at this uh, Flying J up here in... Uh, Sioux Falls, South Dakota. Yeah, we have already Turn made it up to here. Avenue. I know my R. My GPS is wanting me to go make a U-turn somewhere and come back on the interstate because I didn't set it to go here, right? But yeah, this is where I spent the night the other day, and this is where I broke my phone, guys. This is the truck stop. Construction ahead. Yeah, well. In a quarter mile. We're Turn not going to try and do that North tonight, are we? Or today, right? <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna go in here and have me a good breakfast. What do you guys think? Good idea or what? Hot and ready is over there in the orange. You guys see that? That's an interesting one. I've never seen that particular collared truck. Is there a spot right there? It almost looks like it, but I don't know if I want to park up here. I think I'm gonna go park over there. I kind of like parking over there. It looks like there's room there too to just drive through. Now, I know I sometimes say, well, you know, don't always drive through, but hey, why not do it today, right? I almost never do. I almost always back in. Let's go see if we can just drive right through and go in and have us a good breakfast. I'm due for a breakfast, I tell you. Let's see if we can actually drive through. There is another truck, there's another trailer right there. Let's see if I can manage. I think I should be able to. I just got to cut it a little wide up here and I should be all right. Let's see if we can squeeze it in between here. Let's go real easy. We don't want to hit his mirrors, right? Yeah, just barely missed it by four inches. That's more than two inches. <laughs> yeah, there we go. He did a good job there. 
Anyways, let's go ahead and have breakfast, guys, and uh, we'll see what else we can show you today. You should be home today. All right, guys, we are having breakfast now, and let's take a look on what we're having. Oh, my, we're just having our traditional, usual, I guess you could say. But, man, look at that nice, juicy steak, good cup of coffee. So, let's go ahead and have a good breakfast and get out of here. Get back on the road. It looked like I saw some other trucks. It looked to me like they uh, are running into ice fog. So, hopefully, it won't be too bad. All right, guys. It is time to leave this fly and hook up here and uh, head that away. That is north. So, let's go see if uh, we run into any kind of... Uh, ice fog today i really hope it ain't gonna be too bad by but by the looks of things it looks like it is going to be bad but oh well well i guess we'll find out in a little bit once we hit the road right i just came from over there behind me and you can almost see the sun over there it really does look that way at least it's not windy today like a couple of days ago it was pretty windy but today it's not bad so but yeah you guys see that the sun is almost coming through and behind me there but ahead of me ah uh, not looking so good i am now in north dakota ladies and gentlemen we are just giving her today that's for sure after we had us a good breakfast took on down the road and we're now in north dakota like i said we're getting actually very close to being in uh, Grand Forks, North Dakota. And I sure hope we don't have a big lineup at the border like we had a few days ago. Man, you guys saw that? Oh man, that took an hour and 10 minutes just to get to the booth and then I had to go through the scanner and all that. I probably wasted an hour and a half just at the border trying to uh, get across, right? So that took forever, but hey, that's just how it goes sometimes, right? It really does. Anyways, uh, we did get quite a bit of ice fog here for a while. Like I showed you guys in my previous clip, we had some fog, ice fog. And it was pretty heavy there at times for a little while. And then it just started disappearing and now you can see it looks like there's still a little bit of fog in the air but it's not like real heavy duty ice fog anymore so that's kind of nice I like that but anyhow let's get on down home sweet home and uh, we'll be with the family tonight I have just gotten home guys let's take a look who's here <laughs> Who's here? Oh, no. huh? oh look. Who's this? Who's this? Daddy Nahisi Kuma? Oh, she didn't notice me coming in yet. Right, Jesse? You didn't see me coming in yet. Yeah. Anyways, we just got home, so. I gotta get all my stuff from the car yet. What time is it? Supper time, yeah. <laughs> Wife made a really nice spaghetti. Yeah, that's right. Really nice spaghetti. Some chicken over there. Some schmontfat over here. <laughs> yeah. So, let's go ahead and have us a good supper and uh, spend the rest of the day with the family, right? And happy Thanksgiving to you guys out there in the States.